roof rats, sewer rats, we're, we're about, about to, to figure it out right now. now. All right, guys, so in today's video, we're out here in Palm Springs helping our customer, Gary, who has been dealing with rat infestation for how many years? Six years. Six years, had multiple professionals out here to try to stop it, found us on YouTube, and we're here to solve this for him once and for all. And we also have a special guest in this episode, guys, a guest that really means a lot to us that literally started our entire careers and you're about to meet him very very shortly so you can see gary's house here he's got a two-story house and a lot of exclusion work up there he's got solar panels apparently as well so we don't know if they're roof rats or if they're sewer rats and uh, we're going to be making some incisions i'm sure in a ceiling doing our smoke test to figure this out all right now it's time to unveil our featured guest here a person that we love dearly Jimmy. Hey, Jimmy. Nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. you. We brought our dad along with us today. Okay. Cool. Hi, he lives in the area. He lives so. in the area. So oh, he does? Thought. Really? Yeah. Very cool. Oh, right. I read your bio that you started the business, right? Yeah. Yeah. I did, but I, these guys have taken it to a different level. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so proud of them. That's okay. That's very good. <laughs> Sophie. Sophie. Oh. Sophie. Hey, she you. just had a haircut. Hey, Sophie. Can you she's, tell? She's embarrassed. <laughs> hey, Sophie. She's having a bad haircut. Adorable. Day. So what tell you? us a little bit of the history. How long have you been dealing with, with the it? rats? Yep. Long time. Long time. Six, six, seven, eight years. Yeah. What really made it horrible was when we had the water leak and we opened up the wall okay. and it's like they found their way in and ever since then it's like they're really going after us now but i've been just hearing them like mostly in this room for years and years um i'd hear them up here i'd hear them over there and and i've been after them i mean i'm mr trap center and i catch them you know catch them on the uh the wooden traps? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I catch them inside and out. I, I mostly catch them on the outside over there. They're very persistent. So right persistent. here you would say is the most activity? Or and then the tub area, right? Or, yeah, yeah, tub area and and also, um, well, I'll show you. We'll go in there. My, my office, I was sitting in the chair one day and I hear this, D -d 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 -d. I look up and he's like right in the vent looking down at me. Yeah. And, and actually, that tub area is, right? The tub area is like over in that corner there. Yeah. This area here? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go take a look at that bathroom. Okay. So this is really disgusting. Uh, this was probably six, eight weeks ago. Peggy calls me in here and she goes, what are those in the sink? I looked at them and I didn't want to tell her. They were maggots. <laughs> oh. And they're dropping out of this. They're dropping. Okay. Um, yeah, they're softened here. Yeah. Okay. So obviously there was a dead one up there. This is where, see, so they opened up the whole wall all the way around here when the water leak happened. Okay. And the day after they finished, you know, mud and all that stuff, one chewed a big hole right through here. Really? Right in there. Yep. Okay. Yeah. And, I, and it was weird because I, as soon as they opened up the wall, you know, they, they, they covered it with all the plastic and all that stuff that they sure. do. But immediately, and then they pulled the toilet. Immediately, I started seeing droppings on the floor in here. But, you know, I, I hear them up here. I hear them running across the metal part on the top of that. Okay. You'll hear them around in the walls in here periodically. Oh, one in the vent looking down at me, <laughs> saying hi. If I'd had a BB gun, I would have shot him. <laughs> <laughs> so we don't ever hear anything up here except in the attic. And mostly when we hear it in the attic is when I got one with a trap and it didn't kill it. The attic access is right there. I'm in and out of there okay. almost every single week. We caught, the, the, the guys were here a couple days ago. There was a dead one up here. There was a dead one the week before. It just keeps going just... and going and going. All right, we got to open up right here. Yeah, this is the hot spot right here. So we're gonna open this up and then perform the smoke test. This is gonna be a challenging one. Challenge accepted. No. All right, so we've got the 
bathroom here completely covered. Preparation for the soffit opening. Look at that, bird. All right, so we're gonna sanitize all this. We had to remove that section of duck because that was fully impacted. But you could tell that they've had a field day here. It's amazing the type of destruction that they uh, cause here. All right, we're gonna start performing the sanitization. So we've got this vent here off of our vacuum. So any odors, particulates, it'll be going out to the outside. Okay, we have a quick update here. So we just opened up that soffit above the sink. So yeah. Check it out. Look at the, look at all look at all of that. Mm. Beautiful. A dead bird too. Looks like a dead bird, yeah. But what's happening, Gary, Peggy, this soffit right here, there's a, that opening that I showed you, yeah. there's electrical there. So what they're doing is the, the hot spot is above that shower and lav, but the reason why they're getting in here is that one opening mm -hmm. where that wire is. So okay. we'll definitely exclude that. Okay. But we're going to continue on now and open up above, above your shower much. now okay. so we can get a better visual and then we're going to start right on the smoke test. Great. All right, so Dave's going to head up to the attic and inspect that real quick. We've got their closet here completely contained plastic flooring there's the attic access right there a dead juvenile here okay it looks like uh jimmy's up on the roof running the camera we smelt the hint of urine in one of the vents so we ran the camera he says he found a breach what did we find jim so i ran the camera about oh uh, five six feet and you could see where there's a separation, separation and some chew marks on this ABS. Check it out. No way. Yes. Oh, you see that yes. right there? Right there. See oh. That gap? And you can see the chew marks there as well. Yeah, right on the edge there. So now we need to get inside the house and figure out where that is inside the wall or ceiling area. Good job, guys. Yeah. I knew when we were running smoke, we weren't getting any smoke anywhere, so. Actually, Dave had the idea to run the camera through this inch and a half vent after we did the sniff check. You could tell there's that little faint smell there, so it's gonna be interesting what we find. Man, Jim, that sewer camera. I wish I had one of those back in the day. That thing is amazing. Isn't it great? Oh, what a lifesaver. Four and a half feet or so is where the, so it, it 90s, and then about four feet down, saw the breach where all the rats are chewing on the plastic. Yeah. Sweet. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna pull out our locator and try to find out where that breach is here. Jim, Dad, tell Jimmy to make sure it's on locate because it's kind of going everywhere. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and open up this area right here. This is where we determined when we ran the camera where there's a possible uh, breach right in this area right here. So we're gonna build the containment, protect the indoor air breathing space and see what we can find here. It's gonna be interesting. Good. Perfect. Good. Perfect. That's a good place to open right there. Yep. I think it's gonna be to the right of that. Yep. But. So we're opening it up here. See the two inch line, Dave? Oh my God. Check it out. Look at the, look at the amount of droppings in here. Look at this all the way back here. Look at this nesty material right here. So we found a lot of droppings, but no pipe. So we're still on the hunt on where that's at. So you got my dad even trying to figure it out. Tape measures. I mean, between the three shulkies here, we got to figure this out, Dad. We'll get it. I mean, we count no on worries. you with all your experience. <laughs> yeah. No pressure. Wow. What do you think, Gary? That's a freaking mess. Unbelievable. They were having a field day up here. Yep. Wow. Not pretty. Nope. <laughs> I think my boy David found it. I hope. Well, guys, the big find is right here. That's where they're chewing. Look at that. This is a tough one to repair because you've got all these water pipes here. So, I have to open this wall here. Wow. 
Way to go, boys. Super, super happy. Yeah. We've got some good news for you. Okay. Okay, so I'm up in the closet. We opened up the ceiling. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. Booyah. Wow, that's a big hole. Yeah. That is a drain pipe. That is a drain pipe. Yeah. That's a big hole. That pipe drains those two labs, uh, the yeah. sinks mm -hmm. in that yeah. bathroom. Wow. wow. So came up from the sewer and chewed their way out yes. of that pipe. Yep. Exactly. How yeah. often is that lav, how, how often is that vanity being used, those two? Rarely. 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 Yeah. Rarely. That's why. So what we need, what needs to happen now is that needs to get repaired, right. and then another smoke test just to right. make sure that there's no other breaches in the system. Right. And then I think what we can do tonight is we'll start trapping. Mm -hmm. All right. A lot of people think, well, wait a minute, with that size of a hole, why is it not leaking? So Jimmy's gonna go upstairs and run the water, and you can see. There we go. You can see, there's no water leaking. Just flowing right by at the bottom there. Now it would leak if there was a backup downstream of this, if there was a clog, it would definitely leak. But Found it after six years of dealing with this. That's the most gratifying of our job is we come in and actually find those entry points and disrupt these rats. There's nothing like it, guys. Absolutely nothing like it. Also here to have my dad here is pretty special. Really, really special to have him here on site. So I love that man. I have so much gratitude for him teaching us plumbing from the ground up. Man, to have that skill set from him, so much gratitude, man. Love you, dad. Love, love, love you. Okay, Enrique is cutting out the pipe. Let's take a look at this thing here. There it is. All right, guys, so we're gonna put in a new piece of pipe through there, get rid of that old chewed up rat infested pipe. Gary, yeah, use your souvenir. <laughs> Here's I, shall, your... I shall treasure that always. Look at that. That is amazing. All right, we're installing the new plumbing. Brand new pipes. Horizontal is in, and we'll bring it down here on the vertical and connect that piece. Okay. Really a tight, tight spot. That's good. Okay, we're setting up the cameras to monitor for Gary and Peggy for the next 24 to 48 hours. All right, it's getting late. Time to clean up. Excited to see what we find in these cameras and walls. Hopefully we catch a lot. All right, so we've got everything covered here. Got that patch covered. We've got the camera inside there. Containment's coming down. All right, we're all, Rock we're all done for the day. But the main thing is really to monitor over okay. the next 48 to 72 hours. Okay, okay. But super happy with our findings today. Yeah. Me too. Yeah. yeah. Extremely happy. I like it. might even say grateful. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, really. Well, thanks for having our dad with us as well. That was of awesome. Course. I appreciate well, that. That was fun. Got the whole family. The whole family. The family affair. <laughs> it was a pleasure meeting both of you. Very nice, nice to meet you, you sir. Too. Get in here. All right. In rats. Spanish, what do they what do they call uh, rats in Spanish? Ratones. 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 Okay. Ratones, here we go. Ratones. 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 Right. How do you say it? Los cazadores ratones. Look, there's a rat right here. Look at him. Yeah. <laughs> no. Where's the thumb bend? No hay, say no hay más ratones. Okay. No más ratones. No más. No más. Okay. No hay no hay más ratones. No hay más. No hay más. No hay más. No hay más. Ratones. Well, guys, what a big fun here for Gary and Peggy. Having our dad along the day was awesome. It was special. Uh, he gave us some insight, so he, he still has it, guys. Still has it. Yeah, it was awesome. Well, as you can see, it was definitely sewer rats. Anyhow, leave your comments, hit that subscribe button, and we'll, we'll see, see you on the next one. one.